Dearest Alyssa, how have you been? I think of you every day. It seems such a long time since you started your life at boarding school. It was after your beloved grandfather went missing while traveling three years ago that I sent you away to boarding school and told you not to come back for at least six years without giving you any explanation. It must have been very painful for you and I'm sorry, but it was for your own protection. Now, your 15th birthday is approaching and I fear your life may be in danger more than ever before. Please go into hiding until your 15th birthday has passed. I know that what I am saying will make no sense to you, but please do as I tell you and hide as quickly as you can. Your loving mother, Nancy. Mum. Alyssa, you're wanted on the telephone. It's your mother. Hello? Mum? Hello? Are you there? What's wrong? Answer me. Hello? Hello? Mum? Hello? Mum? Mum? Answer me. Mum, I'm back. Excuse me, are you one of the lodgers? Yes, I am. Oh, I'm Alyssa, Nancy's daughter. Um, do you know where my mother is? Your mother has gone out. That was early yesterday morning. Huh? She mentioned that she would not be coming back for some time. What? She was wrong. She won't be coming back at all. So it's just you. You are all alone in this world now, little girl. <laughs> My sweet Alyssa. I've been waiting so long for this moment. Get away from me!
Mum, I came back home. I know you told me not to, but I couldn't help it. I'm so worried about you. Where are you, Mum?
Melissa. May, I have to tell you something important. Daddy's going off to war. War? I hate the thought of leaving you here all alone. I feel dreadful. I'll be all right. But, but what about you? You'll miss me and be sad when you're in war, won't you? Yes, yes I will. You're the most precious thing to me in the whole world. But don't worry. Daddy, don't forget the piano concourse is on Christmas Eve. The winner will have their performance aired on the radio. I'll practice really hard and win the contest so that you can hear me when you're out in the war. That will be wonderful. The competition will be stiff, but if you go to your lessons and practice properly, I'm sure you can do it. I'll practice every day. I've already chosen the piece I'm going to play. Listen. You told me this watch was a present from Mummy before you got married, remember? I'll play this tune on Christmas Eve, so you can think of Mummy and me. Then it'll be like we're all together again.
me out, little girl. They thought they got rid of me that day when Carlos did the girl. Little May was only the beginning. Why? Why did you kill her? <laughs> You're next. <laughs> is dead. There was an explosion. A shell. I'm so sorry. Please don't cry. I understand how you feel. I never even knew my father. I lost him soon after I was born. But I love my grandfather just the way you love your father. Keep this watch as a memento of your father and continue to practice the piano as hard as you can. 
You know that would make him happy. May. May. Daddy! Thank you, May. Your beautiful playing has brought me back to you. At last, we can be together again. Thank you, Alyssa. Thank you. Thank you. Goodbye, May. Goodbye, Mr. Norton. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye. was a goner for sure. <laughs> Long time no see, Alyssa. I haven't seen you since we were in primary school together. It must be three years. What do you think you're doing entering a lady's residence through a window? I have to give you something. Ah, here it is. It's the key to my grandfather's room. Mother always had this key with her. What are you doing with it? You saw her? When and where? Calm down, calm down. It was yesterday morning and your mother drove by in her car. Oops. <laughs> and she said you might come back from boarding school and ask me to hand that key to you if she wasn't back in time. She must have known I'd disobey her and come back here. She must have gone up to meet me. We just missed each other. Hey, Alyssa, you've really changed since I last saw you. I'm going to go and check my grandfather's room. Hey! Well... It looks like you've grown up too, Dennis. Oh, come on! That was then and this is now! Wait a minute, would you?